us to be that will not just be people who get uh, up there. We get stuff. We get stuff that will not be coming from a, this is the way to roll to be, this is what we think the scripture says, this is what we think the good guidelines. It has to be good guidelines. That's cool. So, um, stuff about today's message. Let's go to the Lord in prayer. Hey, God, thanks so much for these group of folk who would come here as a family uh, to worship you.
said this. They said, God, I, I don't know who you are or what you are, and I don't even know if you're real. But if you are, I'm asking for your help. I'm dying of alcohol and drugs, and I'm asking you to help me to somehow get clean and sober. If you're real, would you prove that? Thanks. So they said, amen. I think I said, bye. Thanks. Bye. Bye, God. I'll get back with you later.
same way we get through cycles where for a while or for a year or six months or a year, things have been doing great. But you know what? We've got little distance between us and we weren't doing very good. And I took hold of it. I mean, think of Pastor when think of this stuff. Do we agree? I just got to hand it to me. At that moment, I remember it. Some of you are like, oh, Pastor Jerry's a terrible pastor. He should be gone. Hey, you don't need to take me to the woodshed. God's done plenty of that since that moment. I will guarantee you.
this was with a piece of paper that had been on my mom's refrigerator for like 10, 15 years. And this was a half a sheet of paper, and all it was was a prayer of my mom. She's been in heaven for five years, praying that her kids would know healthy eating habits and be delivered from unhealthy eating and live lives, healthy lives that would honor God. And it's like, Thank you. 